Hi, I'm Carol Alexander, Executive Editor of Crochet World Magazine. Welcome to a short preview of the exciting projects featured in our August 2012 issue. Our cover project and winter circle feature is the Ring Toss Afghan, designed by Barbara Warren Works. This creative design features large motifs with raised rings that give it a unique dimensional look. It perfectly complements a contemporary decor, but here's a fun twist. Laid flat on the floor, kids can use it as a game mat to try their skill at tossing coins into the rings. Our special sections in this issue feature projects for outdoor days, back to school, and folk art. For enjoying the great outdoors, our colorful On the Edge pillows by Carrie Carpenter and Sunflower Chair Pad by Lori Zeller will add some color and style to your porch, patio, or deck. A family picnic will be even more enjoyable with Cindy Adams' soft, cottony picnic in the park blanket to spread on the ground. And hikers, bikers, walkers, or joggers will find Heather Sprout's Water to Go bottle cozy handy for taking along a cool drink on outings. For school, boys and girls will absolutely love the adorable animal backpacks by Jennifer Serka. They're just as versatile and practical as they are cute. Teachers will appreciate the classroom accessories basket by Melissa Horazuski for keeping supplies neatly stored. And the oversized pencil mug rug by Kathleen Stewart is large enough to hold a drink and an apple. Kids are sure to find their written assignments more fun to do with the colorful, glitzy, and just plain fun sparkle pens by Deb Arch. Our focus on folk art includes several projects with traditional designs. The Fence Rail Afghan by Kathleen Stewart features an old-time quilt pattern that resembles a split rail fence. Our extra-large double-duty potholder by Joyce Geisler highlights a primitive art design, and traditional patchwork is creatively rendered in our fun, colorful yo-yo patchwork placemat by Susan Salakian. For fashion and style, you'll feel and look great in our comfortable Autumn Days jacket by J. Aaron Boland. It's perfect for late summer days and also makes a great layering piece for fall. Susan Lutz Kenyon gives her basic stitch ribbon weave scarf a glitzy upgrade with the addition of woven stripes created with ribbon yarn. It's so easy to turn something so simple into something special. The fabulous large size Greenfields tote by Sharon Mann for Red Heart is roomy enough to carry all your take along necessities and double strand construction makes it extra durable. Thread lovers are sure to enjoy our Scrap Delights feature, the Charming Cupcake Baskets by Nancy Nairing. Three different designs give you lots of options for decorating your party table for different occasions. Our Just Threads design is Agnes Russell's beautiful Queen Anne's Lace Doily, created with dainty blossoms that mimic this wildflower's delicate beauty. It may be our beginner's luck pattern, but crocheters of all skill levels are sure to enjoy making Deb Arch's Flower Jewelry Keeper. It's not just for jewelry. It's great for keeping any of your small treasures safe and handy. Rounding out this exciting issue is Catherine Ng's gorgeous Bricks and Squares Throw. It showcases in brilliant color a different version of the old-time bricks and cobblestones quilt design. And what little boy or girl wouldn't look and feel great this fall in Amanda Saladin's all-over pullover? This nicely detailed, textured sweater features ribbed trim and a cozy hood and kangaroo pocket. I hope you have enjoyed this visual journey through our August 2012 issue. And until next time, I wish you happy days filled with the joy of crochet.